some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Are y'all sure y'all ready to run to see this? All right, guys, here goes nothing. Hey, everybody, it's me, Dana, AKA Triple C. Welcome into my channel, Creatively Creative Crochet. Please hit the thumbs up, the subscribe button, and don't forget the notification bell and put it on all so you know when I'm bringing new videos, tutorials, giveaways, live streams, and so much more. Today is Vita Day number 18, and I'm so happy to say that in 10 short days, it'll be my birthday, August 28th to be exact. I'll be celebrating 36 years if the Lord gives it to me. So guys, I need to tell you this video. I'm excited about it. Um, I was excited about it when I was going to film it, uh, when I had the ideas of what to film and how I was going to put it out there. But guys, for those who had no idea, it's been a long week for me. School has been starting and I have had the responsibility to do everyone's hair. If you didn't know, I am a licensed cosmetologist of 13 years and the whole family, when they need their hair done, I'm the one to do it, which is no problem for me because I enjoy what I do and I enjoy keeping the family's hair together as well, growing it and, you know, making them look their best selves when they're needing to make that happen. So each hairstyle all week long has been taking at least over anywhere from six or more hours. Many of them are about 12 hour shifts of these hairstyles. Why? Because I've done several different different steps. Some of them were chemical steps. Some of them were uh, conditioning steps, whatever they may be. And then all of the st steps required long hair and thick hair. So they were all tedious. And you guys, many of you know, I do not do any type of tedious works because I don't like tedious works. This right here, what I'm wearing is a simple shawl from Nana's Crafty Home. Hey, Nana. Hey, Tanya. And I use fingering weight yarn for this. I did double it up and I did use a G hook, but guys, this was a little tedious, but the work that I've done all week long was super tedious, so tedious. In fact, I stood up most of the time for these hairstyles and guys, by the time I was done, I was out of it. I was super drained. And with all of that going on, guys, I had no idea what was happening behind me. So I'm going to show you something. And again, you may want to close your eyes or close your kids' eyes if they're watching right now, because this can be a little disrupting and a little heartbreaking, but it's Veda and it's Veda day number 18. So I'm going to share with you a little bit what's going on because we're family, right? So for those of you who had no idea, I've been doing PNK Puzzle Play with Dr. Katrina and Mindful Crafts more and also Priscilla at Distinctive Crochet. I'll have their information down below. Please make sure you watch their videos and check out their progress. Root them on and see what kind of incentives they have in each video because there's incentives in each video. So you don't want to check, you don't want to miss out on that. Also, Dr. Katrina and Mindful Crafts and more is doing an amazing monetization celebration as well as a challenge called Socks Not Socks, which is challenging us to use sock yarn to create something other than socks. Priscilla has Distinctive Crochet has an amazing channel, and her sons are even joining in with the P&K Puzzle Play. So I encourage you to join their channel, subscribe, and show some love to them. Again, their information will be down below. So they had started this puzzle, and they began doing it, and I fell in love with the collaboration. I also fell in love with the puzzle play and also the amazing tidbits that Dr. Katrina has been giving along the way. I enjoyed the camaraderie as well as just the challenging the mindset. So I decided to join in uh, and I talked about that I had the puzzle and Priscilla at Distinctive Crochet sent me a puzzle mat and I enjoyed using it. So there's been days where I've been on the porch using it. There's been days I've been inside using my mat and my puzzling. Normal days, I will put it up because I will just, if I'm not using it, I don't want it in the way because that was the reason why I needed a mat in the first place because I would keep my puzzle together and not have to worry about any issues. But this week being super long, I would wind down after doing some hair when I got a chance, if I had one, and I would lay on the floor and I would do a little puzzling just to relax after such long, tedious days of standing up and doing long, long, tedious hairstyles. And after today, doing a long, tedious hairstyle, which took two days, doing my daughter's long hairstyle, I happened to turn around to see this. This is my puzzle. This is my mat. 
And this is the mess that I am left with. Guys, my heart was absolutely broken to see this. I have no idea where to begin, but I know I have to get back on ball. So, guys, I'm going to bring you with me as I try to salvage my puzzle as well as add more to it. It's P&K Puzzle Play, guys, and this month is not holding back. This month is almost over, guys, and I have to get to it. So, kids, if you're closing your eyes right now, you can open them if you want to see this. But if not, just look away. Guys. Pray for me while I work on this puzzle. I'm going to bring this camera overhead, taking you with me, and let's see if we can get this baby fixed. guys so I worked a little bit on this puzzle tried to get as much as possible done and I went off camera for a second so I can look at the picture because it was a lot of work and I didn't know how much I had done and you know what was going on so I had to see exactly where I was at so I just went and took my time a little bit laid out and just started putting the pieces together so I'll show you what we have so far all right guys so this is what it's looking like what do you guys think I think we got some progress and maybe even a little bit more uh, than I had before, guys. So this is what day 18 is looking like. Happy Vay to everybody. Don't forget to show some love to Dr. Katrina and Mindful Crafts some more and Priscilla at Distinctive Crochet, who are also tapping, who are also the creators of the amazing PK puzzle play. They are also doing this puzzle along with ML and Art, as they are doing a great job as well. So, guys, please don't forget to show some love to their channels. All the information is in the description box. And 
I have gotten me some amazing dopamine from a little puzzle play. But now it's time for me to get a little dopamine from a little salmon filet. Until next time, thank you for watching. Remember to live on purpose and to love on purpose. Love ya. Thank you.